This is my review on the Septuagint with the Apocrypha. And it's by Brenton. It's a hardcover. And it is so it is actually glued. You can see there, it's just glued. But it's standing up quite well. Um, this book is actually printed in the United States. And this is the 2016 edition. This is actually the second one I've had. The first, the one I had before this actually fell apart. It was an older, a really old one that fell apart. So I bought this one. The preface, I, I would recommend, if you get this, this, this book, I would recommend that you actually read the front few pages in this book because they're actually quite interesting and here you have the index contents some of the abbreviation notes for the Greek the introduction the introduction to it and the, and the history and that behind the Greek version of this Old Testament like I said, I'd read this because it's actually quite interesting. A better understanding of the works of this book. There's only a few pages of it, it's not that much. And then we get into Genesis. And as you can see here, we have the Greek on the left. And on the right, we actually have the English translation. It's quite nicely printed. I don't know, there's not really any line matching or, but there's not really much ghosting because it's a bit thicker by paper than, it's actually quite nice paper actually, but it's actually thicker than Bible paper. And you have your footnotes down the bottom in this book. She does lie flat eventually, just there sort of. It's a great reference book this. You can see all the footnotes, the Greek footnote, the Greek text footnotes at the bottom for you. And up here you have you have it you know, the kings in English and then you have it have it there in Greek in, in Greek. And we have all the whole Old Testament and then we go into the Apocrypha which is here and keep going here we have, you have the, the appendix and we have a few sheets of blank paper here, so if you want to do some notes, you've got that. And here, we have book introductions as well to this. They're only short, brief ones, but it gives you an idea of what you're reading if you've never read these books before. And it's the same as well. You have the Greek on the left and the English on the right. And there's the order of the books. I'm not sure. I don't think this book comes in a leather or anything. It's just a. It just comes in a hardback, as far as I know. I haven't seen any other versions of of this book, only this one. The writing in English is around a seven and a half to not quite an eight. And the Greek would be around the same. No, 
Greek maybe a bit, maybe about an eight. But the Greek's actually quite, Greek's actually quite easy to read. It's quite well printed. Where the English sometimes it, sometimes the English is a bit blotchy. But the Greek's actually quite good. And then you don't get no maps or anything like that at this. Like I said, I just use this as a reference book. And that's it. If you're interested in buying one of these, they're not that dear. I think I only paid around 30 30 or 40 dollars for this book new so it's not a bad book to have in your collection in your in your study it's quite it's quite quite nice looking actually and the back's just black just completely black And as you can see, I've read a bit of it and I've got a few notes and stuff inside it. And yeah. And like I said, the Greek's actually quite well in this. The English isn't too bad, the printing. And like I said, it is full of your footnotes down the bottom. And they have the little symbols, so you'll find it up here in the. You find it up here in your Greek, the symbols. You what? I'm not sure if you will find it. Oh, yeah, yes, you will. You find the symbols also too here. In the English. I thought it was just in the Greek that you found the symbols, but no. You actually find them in there. So they and the symbols are down here for your translations. For your footnotes. Alright. Well I hope that helps. Because I haven't seen another one in I've seen another one of these on the on YouTube. So and thanks for watching.